The Senate don't vex put for the way kidnapping take the Boku inside along the popular Abuja Lokoja Expressway. This na road where they link the northern part of the country to the southern part. Now Senator Dino Melaye, where they represent Kogi West, now he raised this matter, give the house. He advised Senate to work fast, fast, so that they will fit protect lives plus property. Senator Dino Melaye yan this one, say kidnap up to, say then kidnap up to 20 people and then killed eight people inside September the 24th this year. The senator even say press people no report this matter at all at all as nobody take here. Time for the Senate to enforce, Mr. President, what I call citizen diplomacy, where the life of every Nigerian will matter to the Senate, to the security agencies, and to the executive arm of government. Mr. President, while I will not want to belabor us with unnecessary commentaries, the time has come more than ever before for us on the top of our voices call on our security agencies and the federal government to save the lives and properties of Nigerians. Mr. President, it is becoming traditional, it is becoming ritualistic, the issue of kidnap not only on Abuja, Lokoja Road, in every part of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. The issue of kidnapping and banditry is virtually everywhere. It used to be limited to some uh, section of this country, but it has even come to Abuja, where we used to feel it was safe. Even in Asokoro, Asokoro, a girl was kidnapped in Asokoro at 7 p.m. So the Abuja is not safe. And the small villages are also not safe and nationwide. I come from Gombe State. In the last one or two weeks, we had many incidents of kidnapping in Gombe. Just two days ago, the kidnappers even went to a market. They had the courage to go to a market and give notices that people should give them this or money, otherwise they will come for them. The bandits or kidnappers use telephone lines to negotiate. So it means there will always be a lead to where or who they are. So we need a committee on communications to take it up with the Ministry of Communications and see how far they are going ahead with what uh, the minister said they will do. Uh, the last count I was told, two million lines have been blocked. I think we should go far beyond two million lines. But our committee on security uh, agencies will definitely have to uh, to ensure that these security agencies will do something. And maybe we will be a little bit radical. We need to give the security agencies some more funds, but insist, insist on accountability. It's not enough to give them money. We must see how they utilize the money. We must insist on that. And if we do that, we also insist that uniformed people must not join the train because they are the ones that are supposed to protect us.